I'm going to weigh in on this Confederate flag thing. What do you think about that? Alright, I'm going to weigh in on the Confederate flag thing, but not in the way you think I'm going to weigh in on this. What I want to tell you is, we are now going after some things which are pretty stupid. I just read that the TV land has cancelled the Dukes of Hazard because of the Confederate flag. Really? Seriously? You've cancelled the Dukes of Hazard because of the Confederate flag and it might offend someone. Okay. Let's take this out of context of the Confederate flag. Let's put it into something we can handle, which is way more simple. Let's pick the color blue. To some people, the color blue is calm and serene. To other people, the color blue is cold and icy. Some people look at blue and they think sad. Some people look at blue and they see, see refreshing and wet, and other people just see vastness. Okay, that's all great and wonderful, but it's all in interpretation and intent. If my intent is to show you coldness and I show you blue, then I've done my intent. That's really great. So there are going to be people who will look at that and say, that's really sad. You made me sad. Okay, I'm sorry that that color blue made you sad, but I'm not going to change it. I'm not going to years from now, 20, 30 years from now, change the color blue because people have now found that the color blue is offensive. That's silly. It's part of our history. Now, if you use these things in some sort of way which is meant, sp specifically, meant to offend people, which I would have a feeling that the Confederate flag on in uh, the Dukes of Hazard wasn't really meant to offend people, just throwing that one out there. Uh, the Dukes of Hazard, I don't know, probably wasn't that offensive of a show. I remember watching it. Um, maybe I'm remembering it wrong, but I don't think so. We can't change history. I don't want you to change history. I need you to stop trying to change history. So here's what we have. Yes, do I think con the Confederate flag should come off of Capitol buildings? Yeah, yeah. Do I think they should come off of war memorials? No! Uh-uh, no, it's part of the history. It only needs to come off of the Capitol buildings. That's where it stops, nothing else. Taking games out of, out of uh, stores because they involve the Confederate flag? No, you're trying to alter life. Mm -mm. What is the intent? Some of these games are Civil War reenactment games. Um, it's going to be hard to reenact it. What are you supposed to do? Just carry around a stick now? No. Alright, we've gone too far. We've taken it to the ultimate step, which is removing things which don't need to be removed. And I'm going to tell you something else which might surprise you. Intent. Some people look at the, the Confederate flag, which, by the way, I don't think that the Confederate flag most people are looking at is the actual Confederate flag. It's a battle flag, but we won't even get into that issue. Some people look at this flag as a way of looking at the rebirth of the South. There, there are no racist intentions in there. Some people find it as part of their heritage because, well, it was the South. It takes on bigger meaning than just what it was used by for some people who are racist. Some people who are racist wear white t-shirts. Should we get rid of all white t-shirts because people who are racist wear white t-shirts? Hey, they had hair too. Maybe we should all shave our heads because they had hair. No, this is stupid. It all comes down to intent. An item is just an item. Don't give it more meaning. Don't give it anything else. It's just an item. Like I said, I don't think it should have been flown over the Capitol buildings to begin with. That's a whole nother issue. But now you've gone too far. Bring back these flags. Bring back these programs. It's not it's not your doing it's not these people this few who are now saying well this is hurting my feelings it's not up to you to decide about these things the people have free will they they're allowed to have free will i can view this confederate flag however i want to and i being a person who is a minority i'm sorry when i looked at the dukes of hazard i didn't feel anything racist about the flag mm, that's what i'm saying all right enough of my rant for today 
Remember, every Monday through Friday, I talk about a different subject. Share this one. Let other people know how I feel about this, because maybe you feel the same way about this too, in which case you can comment. Don't forget to subscribe right over there. Oh, sorry, right over there. Uh, and also, you can uh, like this and tell other people about this. And I hope I'll see you again tomorrow.